Hello, welcome to Super Fun Raising. This is day 23 and they are bigger. Now they're eating as usual, some of them are resting. So um, just to explain why this is so clean and white, uh, I just changed the new uh, towels and I did a major cleanup on these silk ones. And then so, yeah, that's why it seems so clean as opposed from day 22. And yeah, they're eating as usual, some of them are resting. Today's fun fact or tip is that, did you know that the caterpillars take a month to get big to spin a cocoon? The caterpillars like to spin cocoons and fill up paper tubes. Slice them in half like, you know, slice papers or something. Paper towel tubes, cut them into six slices because, you know, fill up the tubes are really long. Or, you know, you could put them in egg cartons. I prepared one right here, just in case one, um, one starts spinning. And um, you can tell that they are ready to spin when they stop eating and turn yellowish. This silkworm is a sample. Uh, which one did I pick? Like, most of these silkworms are a sample. Like this one. Look. This one. So this one kind of looks like it's bursting. So, and it's not really yellowish. So, yeah, this is yellowish, but it doesn't like it's bursting. So, it'll take a few days. So, just before they start spinning, the silkworm will make a wet, messy poop. To get rid of its get rid of its body of excess fluids. So if you see the um, poop, you will probably need to put them in the art cotton and then they'll start spinning. Oh, that's the head. He's not scared of me. They're very gentle, they don't bite at all. I haven't, like, I don't know any soap one that has bit anyone. They're very simple animals. Thank you for watching Soap Raising. This is day 23. Thanks for watching.